Hi, in this video, we will take a look at how you can automatically set up and restore with a nearby iPhone for the iPhone XS. So this is an iPhone 7, it has an iOS 11 and upwards. So what we do is we just going to restart the device on the iPhone uh, 7 here, on the old iPhone. And this one here is ready to go, it's on a setup screen. Now we just need to start up the device and uh, this device, the older iPhone, needs to have at least iOS 11 for this to work. So this is an automatic update uh, by, uh, uh, by the iPhone XS detecting nearby device. So here it is, it's uh, booting up. So I'm just going to put it close to one another. Switch it off. Okay, do you have this uh, phone bring up the menu? Just swipe up like this. So just then I swipe up, it uh, bring up the menu automatically on nearby screens. I'm just gonna switch off the screen and try it again. So I'm just gonna uh, try to once if you have that problem that it does not, it not show up. Yeah, you probably need to, um, there it is, so I just need to turn off the phone and turn it back on. So I'm just going to turn it off and then turn it back on. And then here we can tap on continued. And then so we need to um, place this circle onto this phone here, so I'm just going to do that. And then it detects. So it says connecting. So setting up language. So probably copy all the settings from this old iPhone over to the new iPhone. Probably um, copying all the Wi-Fi settings. So you can see here, it's Wi-Fi is automatically connected. So I tap on continue. Then I tap on set up later in settings. Passcode, don't use passcode. Don't use password. And I'm setting up the Apple ID as well. Just close that. So it's got iPhone 7 backup here, so update backup before restoring, or you can restore, so I can choose uh, by uh, restoring from auto update, or I can update backup, and then before restoring, so I can backup, and then before restoring, or I can choose one of these, so I choose uh, the older one here that I have, so I tap on it. So now I tap on the grade, continued, so I do it manually, so I set up screen time later in settings, don't share, continued, So uh, we're starting from uh, iCloud. So this one here is uh, probably have a backup to the iCloud already. And on this phone here, it's just restoring from iCloud. Okay, after we're starting from iCloud, it's um, the phone is restarting. So it is still doing some uh, setup and restoring. Okay, so after restoring, this is what uh, it shows on the phone. I'm just gonna tap OK on the old phone. And on a new phone, I'm just going to swipe up and it says restore complete. And I'll tap on continued. So it asks me to set up face ID. I'll skip it for now. I'll skip the passcode. And it will go through that setup Apple ID again. Okay, so I click on continue to go to the home screen. 
So that's it. So what it does is it brings over the Wi-Fi settings. Now I click on Photos, it's updating, so it's probably be uh, downloading uh, photos from the iCloud. Okay, after some time, the photo is downloaded and it's pulling uh, the photos down from the iCloud. Okay, the contacts are automatically brought over as well. Now if you have some other settings, it's probably be brought over as well on your iPhone XS. And that's it, that's how you can uh, automatically set up your iPhone XS. Uh, with our older iPhone uh, wirelessly, you don't have to use any cables and uh, it does pretty much everything automatically for you. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.